All right, we're back. Dr. Cuomo in his uh, private office. Uh, we just removed the this bridge. Now there's your your um, block out material, and if you look real close, you can see I already started removing the excess flash. You be real careful. You don't want to create an opening here. So we're going to actually take a scalpel, if necessary, and just trim this very thin flash away. Uh, so wipe that. Okay. So wherever this block out is, and it's all it is is VPS material, uh, NDS from uh, GC, it's supposed to set in like inside of two and a half minutes. So you got about a minute to work with it, but trust me, this one, this, this material does set pretty quick. So I'm just taking a blunt end explorer, and I don't want to scratch the metal. Blunt end explorer, removing the excess, getting that out of there. And um, we'll have plenty, plenty of seal. Let's make sure you have a hermetic feel. You can see where the screw vent hole runs right about here. And then we'll have plenty. See, with a microscope, you can actually do a hell of a lot more uh, work, a lot more work. Close up and a little more precision with everything. So I just took an explorer and uh, I'm going to verify the fit with the, the jig again. That has to be. And um, we'll just dry that ever so lightly with a little bit of air. Okay. I think we're we're set and ready. This looks good. So we'll get a nice seal that'll continue all the way around, even into this area. We don't want any bacteria down in here, but we're so close to the screw vent hole. We're talking maybe a couple tenths of a millimeter, if that, from the mesial. So we have to leave that uh, on there. That would be filled with cement. Okay, so now the, the object of the game is to go ahead and try in try in the bridge, which is right here. Actually the jig, but we can try in the bridge again. We want to try in the jig. Make sure the jig fits. Yeah. I think we'll be fine with that. Actually, you know what? It doesn't matter if you try the jig in it. That really doesn't matter. It's more the bridge. Okay, so we're good to go. Ready to seal things up and glue it in. All right. So we're going to turn our light down all the way. See, so we're just going to turn our light off. So we're going to turn the microscope light off completely. All right. So kind of like trying it in, making sure. All right. Now we can just start the process and we'll, we're going to wipe vigorously. So my dental assistant's ready. She's got everything she needs for wiping. We've got Reliac cement. Um, we're going to bleed some of this out first because uh, it's a new Reliax, so we'll bleed some out. And check it. See that whole structure? See how that is? If you don't check that, see that's hard already? you got to clean that out. So we'll get a new tip and tissue. We'll wipe this and then bleed it out. Just like that. I might even bleed a little bit more. There we go. Okay. Right, tips ready. Right, we'll put this in place. We got okay. So here we go. What I like to do is uh, I like to put it in here, and then I like to squirt a little bit on the model itself, and then we'll assemble the two together. Ready? Here we go. Brushes are ready. And we'll squeeze a little bit out here. Fill it up. Fill it up. And then we'll put a little bit around here. There we go. And we're going to go ahead.
ahead and just seat this. Let it come right on out the top. And we take tissue and just wipe that off first. Make sure it's seated all the way. And just start wiping with a tissue. Just get it all out of there and rotate the tissue. Now we go with our brushes. Okay, brush. The quicker you are with the brush, the better. And clear it out there more. So keeping the pressure in the ponic regions ensures that you're getting a good seat and that there's no hydraulic pressure coming up the other way. Come around to the lingual. All she's doing is just handing me Bendix, brand new Bendix brushes and we're just clearing everything out of the way. She's already set a timer, so we know what that is. It's five minutes from the time you inject it, but again, this is out of the mouth. Okay, so there we go. Look at it more closely. And we just keep clearing, keep clearing. And we'll take a bristle brush to this whole thing and really just clear off the excess. So that's it, guys and girls. We, we just decided to take it to an easier, much easier step and just do this right in your own office. We got all the bugs worked out of it. We added ceramic material when we had to add ceramic material. And uh, we're very confident that uh, this is... Uh, the best way to do it and you're avoiding trouble you know down the road all right and I'll send this uh, video off to everyone I'm gonna let this set I'll show you how we peel out the um, in about five minutes I'm gonna actually light cure this a little bit not that it needs it I use Reliac cement uh, you can use just about any cement you want uh, at this point there's so much built in as far as uh, parallelism so some of you might want to use tempon uh, I'm just not a big fan of uh, once I have it screw retained I'm not a big fan of using any kind of temporary cements uh, timer says uh, probably have another three or four minutes maybe it's that time we're gonna do a little bit of light curing now okay about three minutes all right I'll take my light cure Ask my assistant just to cover up the lens while we cure this. Okay. Very good. Again, simple, easy. and comprehensive. Now we can turn the light back on. We'll get a bristle brush. I'm going to clean this bridge up. I'll do it in my lab, but for now just want you to see what we have here. Everything is relatively clean and seated. This is all excess down here. We'll have to clean that up with the bristle brush. Uh, right now I'm going to go ahead and pull out the the plug and um, that goes one so now you, you can see there's your screw head down there nothing on it no cement whatsoever take this one and pull it out okay oh. nice and easy so it doesn't tear so it's a little more difficult. Okay. So that's holding that one in a little bit. <laughs> All right. Well, this one's going to come out in pieces. We'll get it out of there, though. Uh, this is Dr. Jerry Cuomo. We'll see you on the next video clip. Take care.